two fouls on a cut and then has missed a couple of shots. But he is really working to get in the paint. Curry, catch and shoot. And it's down. And Curry. Coach, we talk about how Stephen Curry has changed the game. You can start to say the same about Nikola Jokic as Looney is wide open. Yeah, it really wasn't a player for the Warriors that was in a position to defend. Here's Curry in the corner. Got another one. Second made three for Stephen Curry. But Gordon switches over to Curry now with Wiggins buried in the corner. Poole, never afraid. And that's why he is lighting the fuse this year. Worked in Denver's favor here at least in the first quarter and a half. Yeah, you have to wonder if the Nuggets are playing off adrenaline right now as Poole goes up and in for an and one. This Denver team arrived going west to east last night, local time. And if anybody has tried to get from the Denver airport to downtown Denver, <laughs> you know it's not a close drive. Players did not get into their beds this morning until after 4 a.m., most closer to 4.30. The team did not get together until a 5. Toscano Anderson denied there by Jokic, even though he's a high flyer. Look at Poole go to work. Oh, what a pass. And Lumpy with a two-handed jam. They've got the matchup they want. They don't want to bring a second defender. Highland just showing it. Now Curry, long three on its way. That's good! Stephen Curry, a little dance. Denver has won the first three games of the season series against Golden State. Pull wide open, and down it goes! Stephen Curry drawing all that attention. Denver has won the first three games of the season series against Golden State. Pull wide open, and down it goes! Stephen Curry drawing all that attention. Derek Greenberg. After he daps up one of his former teammates, the Marcus Cousins. So I spoke to your head coach, Steve Kerr, at halftime, and he had a couple of words that I wasn't able to repeat on television about how you guys were playing in the first half. I did not see Jackie Moon go into the locker room at halftime. What changed? I mean, it's just a mentality. Like, we're still learning how to win as this group. Um, and nothing in this league is easy, so... You just got to kind of dig your way out of the hole that we've been in and just try to find a way to uh, compete. And we did that on the defensive end. Obviously, shots shot start to fall, but if you don't get stops, then um, you got no chance, especially on the road, and that's what we did. But the second straight game, we've seen a new closing lineup with Jordan Poole joining you and Clay in the backcourt. What have you learned about that lineup? I mean, uh, if we, again, if we can defend, uh, there's a lot of scoring out there, a lot of spacing. So uh, we got Loon, uh, Loon doing an amazing job on Jokic down the stretch, and everybody's trying to help. Got a couple steals, a couple rebounds. Um, and then you got to pick your poison. Either you're going to let me shoot, Clay shoot. They left JP open twice, and he made them pay. So uh, guys are trying to build confidence and step up, and you know we got to start trending in the right direction. It's been a special year for you in terms of individual accolades, all-star game, becoming the all-time leading three-point scorer in the history of the league. To get to 20,000 points and become just the 49th man to do that, does that have any significance with you? Absolutely. Every Any accomplishment you do, whether it's individually or as a team, um, is special. Like you said, you work every day uh, to keep getting better. And, you know, the longer you can stay at this level, you know, good things continue to happen. Um, I've been blessed to... Uh, you play this game and do it with some amazing people and uh, hopefully a lot more to come so It's pretty special for sure speaking of special this night started by probably making a moment that will never be forgotten in a 10 year old's life You had the opportunity to meet PJ O'Brien What was that interaction like for you because clearly we could tell what it meant to her as she could not compose herself and keep her emotions That's what the NBA is all about like our fans are everything and um you know, it's a good time to be a fan of the entire league and obviously what we're trying to build here. And I told her, like, I appreciate the support, the love, like that passion for what we do on the court. It makes it all worth it. So uh, I know she was upset Monday and we got to make up, make it up to her. So definitely a special night all the way around. And um, again, that's what the NBA is all about. They're good.